Hello dear children. Welcome back to our English class. Okay. We have finished the supplementary reader. A packed with the sun. Right? I had given so many activities based on the stories. Please complete the activities as early as possible. So that we can revise everything. Okay? Now, let's move to our main reader. Revision. We can start with the first unit. Who did Patrick's homework? Patrick is a little boy who hates his homework. And he likes to play basketball, Nintendo and hockey. Nintendo is a video game. One day when he was at his home, he suddenly found that his little pet cat was playing with a doll. After a few moments, he realized that it was not a doll, but it was an elf. Elf is a little fairy and it has magical powers in it. When Patrick saw the elf, the elf was shouting, save me, save me, because the elf didn't want himself to be handed over to the cat, because the cat was playing with it. And the elf told Patrick that if you save me, I will grant you a wish. Now, Patrick understood that it is a good deal. So, Patrick did what Patrick told to the elf that I will save your life but first you have to do my entire homework. Till the end of the semester that is 35 days. Now, the elf became angry and disgusted. Because he also doesn't like to do homework just like Patrick. But Elf realized that it is the only way. So the Elf agreed to Patrick and started doing the homework. He did not know the concept of geography, history and maths. In his world there is no maths. And history was just a mystery to him. So the elf told Patrick that I will do your homework but you should guide me or sit beside me. And it told Patrick to go to the library and bring books so that we can work on it together. Then Patrick went to the library and brought some books for both of them. And then they worked on it together. Finally, they completed the entire homework. When the time arrived, when Patrick has to go to school, his homework was completed. He submitted his homework to his teacher. Teacher became surprised and his classmates also because they didn't think that Patrick could do it. Patrick got his A's in all subjects. The elf was an inspiration to him. The elf was an inspiration to Patrick. Patrick did his homework entirely for himself. Likewise, we just need a little push whenever we want to achieve our goals or we want an inspiration whenever we get that we can be successful. That is the concern of the entire story. Self-help is the best help. Dear children, this is the summary of the story. 
who did patrick's homework learn and revise the exercises of the lesson okay next poem a house a home this poem was written by lorraine m halley this poem discusses about the differences between a house and a home house is made of bricks stone wood windows glasses etc there will be a yard edges of sloping chimneys tile floors plaster roof and doors whereas home is made by loving family members consisting of brothers and sisters fathers and mothers there won't be any selfish acts within the family members there will be kindness love sharing and caring towards each other within the family next unit 2 how the dog found himself a new master this is the story of a dog who used to be his own master he decided to find a master stronger than anyone else on this earth first he found a wolf as his master but one day he found that the wolf was afraid of the bear so the dog thought that the bear was the strongest of all so he decided to take up service with the bear and he left the wolf after some years the dog met a lion and one day he found that the bear was afraid of the lion who seemed the strongest so the dog asked the lion to be his master and left the bear he stayed with the lion and treated him as his master for a long time one day he found that the lion was afraid of man so he made the man as his master and left the lion the dog remains man's best friend till now so this is the summary of the story how the dog found himself his new master do the exercises collective nouns making nouns from the words by adding ness ity or y learn the dog family opposites etc okay next poem kite the poem kite was written by harry ben an american writer this is a poem about a kite as it flies in the sky the poem creates a beautiful picture of a flying kite the kite when it is new or during its first flight looks so beautiful pretty and vibrate in the blue clear sky the kite with its swiftness and softness in its movement creates a cracking sound we can see in the air it looks so good the movement of a kite is compared to a ship with a sail when a ship captures wind the wind makes the ship move forward similarly the kite also soars 
high with the wind when the wind is strong the kite rises on air just as a ship rises on the waves of the ocean similarly when the wind pauses the kite also comes down to rest when the thread which is tied to a kite loosen the flyer will runs again and rows it back so the flyer then waits back till a new wind blows and again the wind makes the kite fly high once again so dear children this is the summary of the poem kite do its exercises okay today we have revised the summary of unit 1 lesson who did patrick's homework poem a house a home unit 2 how the dog found himself a new master poem the kite dear ones you should read the two units two or three times revise and study the exercises also okay